Welcome back to Share Mobility. This is our third video in our agent role series, and this one is going to focus in on editing and deleting users that we just created. So you can see here, I'm logged into the Share environment. My name is populated here. My organization that I'm a part of is populated here. Obviously, test organization for the purposes of the demo. And then what I can do under my management list, request and users. So I'm going to click into users. And you're going to see Jane Doe that we created on the second video in this series and show you how to go in and update and edit information. So you can hover over the name. And see, I'm right here under Jane, over Jane. Click in and you're going to see all the information populate here. Name, email address, mobile phone, um, anything else that you wanted to have populate in there, address, city, state, when you initially fill them out. So I'm going to go in and update Jane's phone number. And then as you have updates that come through um, or changes that you want to make, once you're done, simply scroll down to the bottom and click Save. And you can see up here, user has been updated successfully. That green check arrow in the top right lets you know everything has moved through um, with no issues on the back end. You can actually click in and see that that change was made. So that is updating or editing any status. Um, the next thing I'm going to show you is how you uh, deactivate a rider. You know, for an organization, whether you're managing employees or residents, maintaining a really clean roster will help you better manage your program. And if you have an individual that has moved on, that has left your work, that is no longer part um, of your facility or no longer a resident, you could go in. So we've got Jane here. We're going to go over to the right. We're going to click that red button, and this is the deactivate user button. Are you sure you want to deactivate this user? I'm going to click OK, and then Jane will delete from the user management role. You can see user has been deactivated successfully. Um, if you wanted to, if you did that on accident or, you know, they came back into the employment or was a, new, was a resident again, you could simply go back under create user um, and create Jane again. So again, this is video three, and we've gone over how to edit users and delete users.